Hey everybody, it's Delta Shiny Zeta here, bringing you another brand new Let's Play. This time we are looking at Chris Tales, a game that officially releases on July 20th, so in just a couple days actually. The game is a mix of adventure exploration, RPG elements, and so on and so forth. I'll be explaining that, of course, as we play through the game. But this game is actually being released for, I believe, five different, actually, sorry, six different uh, consoles. Might be five. Let's count them. There's PC, there's Xbox One, Xbox Ser uh, Series XS, uh, PS4, PS5, and Switch. Okay, there's actually six. Yeah, and it's interesting. Um, it'll be an interesting one. It is actually published by uh, Modus, uh, Modus Games, so you may be familiar with them, of course. But let's go ahead and begin this. Uh, we're going to do options real quick to see. All right, that looks all good there. Music, uh, sound effects. I mean, it's all just music stuff, so, or sound, you know. Mute voiceover. No, we're not doing that. I think that's all fine, honestly. I mean, options is all just sound stuff. Okay. That's fine. I'm gonna do a new game, um, and as we begin, I would uh, like to encourage you to leave a like, comment, subscribe, and turn on notifications if you enjoy the video. Also, make sure to follow my Instagram and Twitter. I do actually make constant updates on those platforms, and it's a great way for you to know what I actually just uploaded without you, you know, always having to be on YouTube. Instead, you can rely on Twitter and Instagram. So I do go ahead and use those platforms very consistently now. Without further ado. Let's get started with Chris Tales. Alright, well, I guess we're getting right into a battle here. Okay. This is a real fight, Chris Bell. Time to use your new skills. Be swift, be precise. First, select attack, and then choose your target. Finally, just as the attack connects, press the button one more time to do a double slash. Alright, so we're going to... Basically, have... Okay, attack, skills, flee, and what's on the right? Attack, skills. We do attack. Okay, okay, I see. That second hit requires precise timing. Make sure you press the button again right as your attack hits the enemy. It takes a little bit of practice um, knowing when the attack is actually going to land. Very good, Chris Bell. There we go. It's not that bad, honestly. Be cautious. Watch for your opponent's attack and press the button right when they hit you to block most of the damage. Yeah, so before I keep going, I will say um, it's actually very similar to Paper Mario, at least the first Paper Mario game, the first two, where it was like a battle screen, and then you press A at the right time and also defend at the right time to do some, you know, uh, they were called action commands in Paper Mario games. I'm not sure if you are familiar with those games, but they were they were great games, honestly. They were very great. Chris Bell, it will strike again. Make sure you press the button. Okay, let's just manage through this because we kind of know what's going to happen. Okay, Careful, gotta learn Chris that Bell. timing. Careful, Chris Bell. Nicely done. There we go. It's about knowing. I wasn't sure if I was doing it too late or too early, but now it's a little tricky. Finish it off. Let's attack. Yeah, it's not that bad. I don't think it's that bad. Well done, Chris Bell, but I am afraid our work is not done here. So that's the first battle of the game finished. Served more as like a tutorial type of battle. I guess this one's going to be our first real battle. Okay, so now we have defend item pass. Delay your access for one turn and allows the next actor in the town to act immediately. Okay, we have flee, as you already know, and then let me read these item. Well, actually, nothing is popping up. And then guard or defend, whatever. Guard until your next turn. Okay. Attack and skills to the left and attack and skills to the right. Let's go ahead and attack to the right. Same with you, I guess I should be attacking the same one. Not bad. I'm Christopher, by the way. Christopher. And now there's the left side. Yeah. 
and battle finish just like that. Yeah, it's not too bad. Uh, when, if you play the game, if you're playing this alongside me, uh, you have to press it a little bit earlier than you would think. That's kind of what I've learned. The timing is a little weird at first, but then you get it and it's pretty simple actually. There. It's too less of them. I've been chasing those things since I left St. Clarity. We've got to stop them before they reach town. And exactly how do you plan to do that? Hold your ground. They won't get past us. Look, Volcano! They broke our poor goblins! How adorable! Can we keep them? Gally, we've talked about this. No more pets until... Until I stop murdering them. I know, I know. I just want to play! Not my fault they're all so... squishy. <laughs> and that's why we can't have nice things. Alright, there's also skills. I haven't... Okay, well, there's no skills. I guess we'll be learning that later. Zero, zero. We can't touch them. Let me try to attack with you, too. And that right there is a general introduction of Chris Tales. I guess we just left that battle in a cliffhanger. But it was a nice way to introduce the combat system, honestly. But here we are in Narim Town, or Narim? Narim, Narim. I'm sure we'll figure it out in just a little bit. I mean, there is voice acting in this game, so that's nice that we get to know how things are pronounced. Always a bigger issue from older games, you know, when there was no voice acting. People calling, you know, kite seeds like Kate Sith and you know, all this crazy stuff. Or like Titus, they call Titus. Alright, how to. Use the left stick to move in the desired direction. Press A to interact with people or objects. Sounds great. We can also press Y for a hint. I should talk to... Oh, there's voice acting for that. Sorry. Alright, so I guess we're just gonna go ahead and talk here. Chris Bell, finally. Did you prune the roses yet? I'm sorry, Mother Superior. It's just my rose. He... the frog. It took it. Enough. Enough. I've seen that look before. Find that rose, then hurry back. There's work to do and no time to waste. Go on. Yes, Mother Superior. Thank you, Mother Superior. And be careful. I worry about you. Okay. So we can just keep pressing Y so we can get the hint system going. Uh, getting the rose back. How did I even go over there? I can't even make it over there. Oh, there we go. Just like that. Okay, let me check over here. So this was the one? That's where I was standing. If I pick every strawberry right now, maybe I won't have to do it ever again. That's not exactly how that works, but um, I appreciate your attempt at logical thinking. These just bloomed yesterday. If I take extra care of them today, they'll be even prettier tomorrow. That's a little bit more logical thinking than the uh, other person. Okay, well, um, I suppose we'll go over here. I think there were a couple things on the left and right over there, but we'll get into that just a little bit later, maybe. We'll see, we'll see. So far I'm enjoying this. The visuals are also very nice, too. Press Y to check out your current objective. Oh yeah, I know about that, okay. What a lovely day for a walk. 
walk in the woods. Let's examine this too. Okay. So north, south, east, and west. Four different locations. And we came from west. Chris Bell, what's the hurry? Good morning, Marco. Have you seen a little yellow frog? A frog? Well, sure. Maybe wearing a top hat? Carrying a rose? A top hat? Then no. Maybe try the mayor's estate. There's always something going on there. I'll try. Thanks, Marco. Sorry to bother you. Are you kidding? That's the most interesting thing I'll hear all day! Alright, so give me a hint there. So we came in from the, uh, the, the Narum Orphanage and it's telling us to go into the... I'm not sure where. It's not any of the locations here. Main Square, Cathedral, Road to Farmlands. Uh, let's try going north to see if this is opened. Okay, so that's actually incorrect. Let's try... East? Nope. All right, so I guess it's south. Oh look, there's more people here. Check out the cool sticker we found. It's a skull. That's cool. Whatever. All right. Uh, let's see here. Oh, I see. East Mayor's Estate. Got it. Got it. So I probably won't be able to do much else here at the moment. Why would someone do this? Not sure what that's supposed to mean. People seem uh, kind of upset here. Okay, let's just go into the mayor's estate and progress the story. We might be able to do stuff here, uh, you know, with these people a little bit later. So let's just uh, make our way through. And not talk to people. Can I go in these doors? Think about the future! It's not just the farms that will be renovated. It's the orphanage, the shops, the whole town! Your future fouls the land, poisons the water. Goblin raiding parties are burning our fields. Money, power, your precious industry. That's all you care about now. How dare you? Where's your proof? Proof? Look around you. Look at our crops. Then sell your lands, Robert. Don't let it trouble you any longer. It's what's best for the town. It's best for someone, but not the town. You seem to be doing just fine. Now, see here, I never... Mr. Mayor, we have a visitor. Hello, Crispell. What do you want? Hello, Miss Lana. I was looking for a yellow frog with a top hat. Of course you were. Try the northern fields. That's where all the little pests go, hmm? May the lady light your way, Criswell. Too many in town have strayed from her grace. Oh, thank you. I should go. Oh wow, there it was. Uh, so I guess I don't need to be coming this way then. What is this thing? It looks like an object of interest. Whoa, it kinda is. Aha! Healing juice was added to your bag. Nice. I haven't even looked at that, but here's the... Ooh, okay, that's pretty cool. Inventory. Healing juice. Restores 120 HP to single target. Contains a mix of fruits that refreshes the user's body and mind. Okay. And then quest log. I don't need to take a look at quest log yet, I don't think. Alright. Um, guess I won't be going this way. Let me just talk to you real quick. Nothing. Wonderful, wonderful. Are these doors? No, right? I don't think they're doors. There's no way. Okay, so we can't go in there. I guess I'll talk to you then. That Marco is never home. He will inherit this one day. He should help me take care of it. By it? Was she talking about the baby? I don't think so. Hopefully not. Northern Fields. Okay. So yeah, I went up here. I believe this sign over here was saying... Road to Farmlands, Narum Cathedral. Okay, it did work. I just kind of guessed. 
But the farmlands would be the one, you know? Alright. Hey, you. Hi, Polly. How are things? I don't know, Chris. Between the crops, the monsters, the weather... It never ends. I just saw your dad with the mayor. They seemed really angry. Again? I keep telling him to trust the mayor. We need his soldiers to protect us. But it's always, we give the lady our trust. Everyone else has to earn it. Sorry, Chris. What's up? I'm looking for a little yellow frog. He was wearing a hat. A top hat. He took my rose. A frog in a top hat? Only you, Chris Bell. I haven't seen it, but I'll keep my eyes open. Thanks, Polly. Maybe I should pray to the lady about it. <laughs> you have been talking to my father. Well, if you're looking for a miracle, I suppose the cathedral is as good a place as any to try. <laughs> okay, there's a frog now. We gotta turn back, apparently. Go back left and up north this time to the cathedral because that's uh, that was the first place we tried, and it was actually closed, so we couldn't make any progress there. The loading screens are pretty average in loading time. Not great, not bad. If Mother Superior finds out I've come here alone. Alright, let's move up north then. Rose was added to your bag. Chosen, my dear. It appears I was correct. Chosen? By whom? What are these crystals? Why me? More questions. The past and the future have revealed themselves to you. Come, see for yourself. I can't! I don't want this! Nothing to fear, child. You have much to learn about your powers. Powers? This is a curse! Why is this even happening? You are upset. Perfectly understandable. But I know someone who can help. He lives in a little hut down by the lake. Leave town? Mother Superior will worry. She would be very worried if she saw you like this. Is it another talking frog? If only. But sadly, no. Trust me, little one. Let us go immediately. Okay, so wants us to go. What east? That will not help. South, south. That's the correct place for sure. It's letting us go south now, so yes. How to? You can save your game while in the overworld. Just open the menu screen and select the save option. Remember to save often. 
Okay. Ah, there we go. The save option has appeared. We're going to save in slot one, of course. And there we go. Nice. But we're not done with this episode yet. We've still got plenty of time. Uh, so, okay, so we can just move around here. Nice. What is the name of this? Okay, so that's closed. Are we telling me? Just a little further. I mean, there's only one location. I think the green rectangles are the locations you can actually examine. No. Not necessarily. There's only two places that we can explore right now. And there's... Wow, it's actually... Uh, it's a pretty expansive right now. I mean, look at this. It's kind of a lot. Alright, let's just go ahead and do what we have to do, right? That makes sense. Oh, shoot. What the heck? I can't go up there. Oh, that's kind of weird. What? How do I... Okay. I thought I could actually like find a way to go in there, but now I can't. Okay. Let's go in here. The only place that we have available for us, aside from our starting place. Here we are. He lives just over there in that hut. Perhaps you should let me do the talking. Sounds great, you'll do the talking. Oh, what's this? This soil, it feels warm to the touch. Interesting. Can I open it? Can I open this? Wilhelm, answer the door! Go away, I'm busy! Open the door, you pompous child! We have important business! Matthias? Huh. Idiot frog! Manners! You're speaking to a revered time mage. Now, who might you be? Crispell. Um, sir? Crispell has opened both crystals of time. Ridiculous. Impossible! Why not even I have been able to? Yet it has happened. No. No, no, no. There's something else at work here. Can someone please tell me what's going on? Patience! I am Wilhelm the Wise. You, it seems, are a time age, as am I. And while my powers have led to my youthful appearance, yours are the gift to see possibility. Possibility? I thought it was the future. Incorrect. It is a possible future. Perhaps a practical demonstration will help. Take this seed and plant it over there. Okay, that's an interesting concept for this game, definitely. I have to go back to a Mother Superior now. Okay. Oh, I have to press A actually to enter the map. Yeah. Okay, I mean, we're kind of learning here as we go, and it's making a lot of sense right now. We haven't gotten into any combat aside from the tutorial part at the very beginning. Right now it's all just mostly town exploration, you know, setting exploration. The typical thing that would happen in the, you know, the beginning of a game, of course. But I'm sure in the next episode we're going to get into some pretty, uh, pretty cool battles, possibly. Alright, so we have to go to, uh, Mother Superior, who's going to be over here on the left side. I 
this way and then straight up. That was uh not good right there. Crisbell, you had me worried. Mother Superior, you're okay. The orphanage is still here. Well, of course. What's got you so excited, child? Did something happen? No, I mean not yet. I went to get my rose, then Matthias showed me how I could Matthias. Yes, he he was just here. I need to find him. At least give me the rose you spent all morning looking for. Yes, Mother Superior. Now, go find your friend. And don't take all day. You still have to prune these roses. Matthias? Okay, the next hint just says Matthias question mark. Let's go back down here. Wow, we're gonna look around town. Okay, have they already said something? I'm just gonna mash the dialogue because there's not really a point to me, you know. So what's interesting here is, so you see this, like, they, how they change? Like the characters, when they're outside that triangle. That is very interesting. Okay, so I've already talked to all these people, I don't need to do that again. Let's go down here. Alright, let's go talk to the carpenter over to the west. Yeah, yeah. Good morning, I guess. Can you help me? There's a problem with the houses. A problem? Great. What did you see, girl? They're rotting away from the inside. In a few years, there won't be anything left. You saw rot on the inside. From the outside? Neat trick. Sounds like someone's been telling you stories about Ash Blight. Happened back when I was a kid. Would have lost most of the town if the old apothecary hadn't brewed up a batch of green leaf tonic. Can you make some? Do I look like an apothecary? Go ask June. She's the one who knows about this stuff. Charming fellow. <laughs> Let me check more to the left, though, if there's anything else. There is not. Okay. Just had to make sure, you know? Why would someone do this? Excuse me. I was wondering if you could help me. You and half the town? No. No, I can't. Someone tore the label off of my mushrooms. That sounds... bad. Bad? It's terrible. One of these is Red Button. Good for digestion, great on a salad. One of them is ground death cap. Even the tiniest bit could be deadly. An important distinction, wouldn't you agree? Of course, with no labels, it's impossible to tell them apart. Can't you just throw them out and make some more? 
Sure, of course. It would take weeks to find the mushrooms, days to prepare them. I don't have time to redo it all. My father used to do all of that. He bottled and labeled them years ago. I'm sorry. I wish I could help. Me too. It'd be nice to have help around here. Since Dad died, though, I try to keep everything the way he left it. But there are only so many hours in the day. Sorry, I've got to get back to work. No wonder she's upset. They all look alike. I suppose they do. Let me try something. Ugh, I can't see them in the past at all. Allow me. Press X to prepare a time hop, then press left stick to make Matthias hop to the past. Uh, okay. X? Oh, I see. You can just go back, too. Interesting. Uh, but I'm actually gonna be, uh, I'm going this way. Because... Well, once the game loads. Yeah, the loading screen is a bit average, but I'm going over here because I actually want to save the game and end the video because we are actually out of time. We're going to be keeping these videos around 30 to 35 minutes apiece, so yeah. Before I end this video, don't forget to leave a like, comment, subscribe, and turn on notifications if you enjoyed the video. I will see you all later. Bye-bye, everyone. Have a great day.